She texts me and goes, Gilbert, I had a weird dream. <gasps> and I went, what? And I'm going to just say the thing, and then you can explain it in more detail. Okay. She said, I had a dream that George ate my butt. <laughs> I wasn't going to tell you. I was only supposed to be for Gilbert. You have a dream. I'm so sorry, babe. That George eat your butt and you text Gilbert and I don't know anything about it. Well, because you weren't going to wake up for another five hours and I had to but tell I someone. I eventually did wake up, bitch. And you could have said, hey, I had this dream. Yeah, but you were. My but the last week you were, you get upset when I dream about Conor McGregor or other people. It That's couldn't... fine, but f <laughs> George? <laughs> I'm so sorry, George. Who would you make Bobby if you if you died? And he, in your will, you're like, Bobby, you have to date this person if I die. I think Bobby would choose a man. I think that he... I think that... <laughs> I, she's just really... I don't, I don't know. She really, really... <laughs> got me. She really is... She really is pushing all the right wrong buttons right now. There's nothing wrong with that. Yeah, I'm not going to choose a dude, baby. I don't think you're gay. Yeah, I'm not. I just also, think you choose a man. <laughs> you know, we were at, we were looking at houses the other day, and she's like, yeah. and I, I happen to want to look at a house that happens to be in West Hollywood. I yeah. love West Hollywood. And, and, her, and, and she, her eyes are, why do you want to live here? Uh, she gave, like, she like gave you a little bit of that. Again, like, <laughs> oh, because I want to dick all day long. I mean, what the f*** are you talking about? It's a nice house. I think I also have just one more gripe. Oh, God. Here we go. Get it out there. <laughs> I am just so sick out. and tired of your f playlist. It's just all oh gosh, white, <laughs> sad, emo, rich boys with f three chords on a guitar. It's always talking about being in a room, and it's all the same. They all sound the same, and it's always just white, sad, yeah. rich boys singing. I'll tell you why. Defendant? Can I tell you why? Defendant, please. Okay, thank ahead. you. Thank you so Is much. Is that all you relate to? I'm a, I'm a, I'm, oh. I'm a upper, oh. Oh. order in the court. Oh. I said order in the court. You shall not do that. Oh. <laughs> I'm an upper middle class white boy. I dressed up yesterday, and he was like, "Who? The, where the f are you going? And who are you f***ing? like?" Because I dressed up. Yeah, the, you. He's see, like, you trying to leave some, me, bitch? Like, no, that's the, here's, every, he drove down there. He did, and he and what didn't would try he do to mask when he came? his filth either. He didn't try to. No, he didn't try. He didn't clean his car. He oh. had piles of like bottles and just dirty underwear. Everything. Oh, he, it reminds he wasn't me of my dad, to... bro. It's so gross. But I was like, okay, well, I I respect that. This is his baseline, and he's not trying to front like he's anybody else. Oh, that's pretty cool. Yeah. So there was no bait and switch, huh? Mm. -mm. Did he? Uh, th there were a few, but more of a. More of a maybe an effort thing, not really a cleanliness thing. From the get go, I knew he was a he was a pig. Hy mm -hmm. you know, hygiene wise. He was a hygiene risk, they call it. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Hepatitis risk. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Definitely. Wow. Are you asleep or awake? I had to get my booster shot. Did you really? Yeah. Oh definitely, yeah. He seemed like that guy, uh, who's definitely got that fever in him. You know, he's got the potential for uh he's got the potential for fever. Liver fever. Oh, if you look, I couldn't even imagine seeing one of his blood cells under a microscope. Who would even know? It's probably just sitting there fucking vaping, you know? Second time was a disaster. Why? Because uh, I didn't realize our height differential at that time. Yeah. And he was trying to, you know, we were trying to do it doggy, doggy style. Oh, yeah. And it turns out his thighs are actually really short. Oh, yeah. So um, he tried. He got I thighs think like a yam. He's built like a yam. <laughs> so he would have had to done a half stand in oh, order yeah. to get there. Oh, yeah. And his thighs apparently were burning. Oh, yeah. So yeah, midway through, through so he was like, I got to go home. I got to go home. And so he just left yeah, yeah, and yeah, he yeah, just yeah, rushed yeah, home. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I... Mm. Won't hit my dog. I don't hit anybody. I got slapped in the face, by the way. <laughs> Who hit you in the face? Kalila. Like, like oh, backhanded my face. Hard? I'm, I have a new girl, guys. Can I tell you about her? Please. Yeah, please, please Bob. Okay, I met her on Tinder, and she's half Filipino. The second, you know, third night we went out. Oh. And she goes, she goes, um, I'm violent. She goes, I'm violent. Wow. I go, what does that mean? And she goes, and she didn't say anything. And then we made out some more. And she goes, I hate you. And she punched me in the face. She really punched you in the face. Guys, as hard as she could. I used to jerk off dogs a lot, but this is like n a known thing when I was younger. I learned from an older cousin. Oh. 
And jerked off tons babe, of dogs, babe. yeah. Come on, man. I believe it. <laughs> I know, know I believe it, but I don't want to hear it. Well, dude, that's co that's just the original coconut water. Dog. <laughs> <laughs> that's you know right. what I'm saying? Before they had coconut water, dude, people were getting doing different stuff. We don't have babies, but we've killed two. Wait, really? Yeah, Kalina just I've been asking her for twelve hours a day, every day. It's like I've been asking, I go, can we have a baby? And she's like, not with you. We have seven animals. We live together. Uh, her niece lives with us. We're a family. I would have turkey basted myself with his sperm, which oh, I would have seen. Oh, that really is, yes. that's hurtful because uh, we killed two babies. Let me, let me okay. actually, yeah. probably, let me, let's assume that it's the same old narrative of me being a gold digger and stealing money from Bobby. Well, I mean, is we, it within we, those lines? We talked about it, yes. You yeah. throw money at my tears, that's not which what, is that's okay. Not, that, that, you, know, uh, you know what? Okay, uh, you know, when you say that, it hurts my feelings. Why? Because, it, because what if we were poor? It would be a, more difficult. If we were poor, Papa, you we would be divorced because there's no way you know how to show me love. What? <laughs> because you throw money at my tears, and if we were poor, what would you throw at my tears? Love. Okay, anyways, let's, let's move on. <laughs> what was that? <laughs> I love you. I love you, okay, Papa. Okay, I love you too. Okay, but what I'm saying is this road of love, this story that we create doesn't have to be defined by such strict rules of monogamy. Whoa, dude, what are you saying right now? What I'm saying is <laughs> Whoa, I would dude. never, I would never... <laughs> I would never betray your trust. I would never do anything <laughs> without you seeing it in broad daylight. What I'm saying is down this road, should you ever come up to me and say, hey, you know what, sweetie, this is what I had in mind and this is what, you know, whatever we need to nope. do to sp nope. Nope. spruce up our sex <laughs> life. Nope, nope. I will not lie. Why are you so... Because this is exactly the road you went down with G-Unit and, and Steve. No, I never, that was the first... I, you're gonna hold me to one relationship. No, I'm saying no. I'm not holding you to it, but I'm saying that these are the seeds that are being planted for that kind of situation. And what I'm saying is, is that I'm not gonna do that. What I'm saying is, yes, I do. Maybe I'm projecting my own, my own. I was with one for about two and a half years. I met the other person. He became a friend of the both of us. One day, it turned into a hey, you know. Let's see if, you know, we could just have, I asked, I asked him, I was like, would you be down if he like joined? Was he in the room? He was, he had spent the night, he was in the shower and we were having Sunday morning sex. And I remember just saying like, I was a little manipulative in the sense that he was a already little. inside me when I asked. <laughs> a little. Mm. You know, I didn't ask beforehand. I am not the one who asked for an open relationship. And no. that's a fact. The truth of that is I intercepted something alluding to Bobby and another woman in Hawaii. That is even how the conversation ended up to having an open relationship. I didn't instigate it. I didn't start it. I didn't cheat. Bobby can corroborate this story. Because I never did anything like that in the 10 years. You know, I never looked at another girl. Yeah. Really, I've never, I, mean, I was very like kind of loyal to her. You know what I mean? There's and no flirtatiousness. I never did any of that. I never hung out with girls really. No, I never did any of that. Right. So you just. Hang I out. thought, no, I, I was honest with him. I started telling him I was desirous of other people and I started to kind of. What does he say when you say to him, look? I, well, it, well, it hurts him, but it's, I, I'd rather kind of, you know. Aww. Do you, do you act out on that? Yeah, I did with him, yeah. I mean, no, so do, you you, do you go out and you cheat on... I, I mean, I never did anything without his permission or without Whoa. telling him first. And is I that, guess it's kind for, of bizarre in that Is that sense. for real? Because that's, that's... Yeah, a, like I brought in somebody in a relationship towards the end. Wow. Wait, but, with him there? Yeah. Whoa. You brought him back to the house? Yeah. And he knew who that other guy was? Yeah, like we kind of... I was in a relationship with two guys towards the end. Whoa. That's awesome. <laughs> and wait, and, uh, and yeah. was it Bobby? For her, for her it's awesome. Hey, hey hold on. Well, yeah. And was this it? Is a he can never betray me. She can, yeah. He she knows never. things about me. She knows things about me, right? 
<laughs> that no one knows. So she, she has me by the <laughs> testicles, right? So, and, and and it's like, you know, I, I allowed that to happen because I love her so much. But she has, you know what I mean? <laughs> she has the information. And I, I'm 